when we were putting this together, there was this strip down the center. We were missing about that much space of this newsprint. And uh, so we thought, what should we put there? And um, I don't know how it happened, but Rand Paul 2016 ah, happened to just fill, just, it just happened to yeah, appear there. You know, you asked me for a theme song. How about Hail to the Chief? <laughs> uh, might be a little bit premature. Can you have my wife on? We need to have my wife and I on together so we can have that discussion. You know, we've talked about it, and I think it's too early to, to sort of tell what to do as far it's as not for It's not for Hillary. Yeah. But, but I will tell you that I think Republicans will not win again in my lifetime for the presidency unless they become a new GOP, a new Republican Party, and it has to be a transformation, not just a little tweaking okay, at the so edges. Okay, so then why are you supporting Mitch McConnell? You know, things are complicated with regard to endorsements, but I would say one, because he asked me, and two, because he asked me when he did not have an opponent and wasn't a choice at that time. But three, also, I am somebody who believes in bringing people together to a certain extent. And I think that uh, he has been a, an opponent of Obamacare steadfastly. He has been a supporter of my movement and Mike Lee's movement, frankly, for a balanced budget amendment. So sometimes I think, and I won't name any names, but sometimes we preoccupy ourselves with the things we disagree with people on. And I am a fusionist. I am someone who right. believes that, I agree. You know, let's say you and I, we have 100 issues. We probably only agree on 95 of them, okay? Yeah. But I would not be the one who wants to come, or if I went out to dinner with you Correct. and beat you up on the five Correct. I disagree I agree. on. I try to bring and think we bring people together to be a bigger party. And I see the positive in people. Uh, as, as long as you're standing not. for, I think there is a limit on that. As long as you're standing for, constitutional principles. If you are violating one of the right. big constitutional principles, well, then I, I, I can't stand with you. But if you want to fundamentally but, transform but, but, America. But, but you realize, Glenn, the only perfect candidate is yourself, all right? Nobody is, <laughs> nobody's perfect. No, other I wouldn't even vote for me, so. That I'm not meaning yourself. <laughs> yeah. okay. I mean, it's any individual. Yeah. The only one you perfectly right. agree with, with is yourself. So anytime you uh, support other people, there will be what yeah, you perceive as being imperfections in the other person. Um, uh, when, when I